And so hemophilia needs to be treated in a lifelong basis. And the only thing that's wrong with people that have hemophilia is that they're missing something in their blood. Other than that, they're completely normal individuals, but they're missing something called factor. In the case of hemophilia B, it's factor nine. And so they need regular replacement of factor nine. Unfortunately, factor nine needs to be given into a vein on a regular basis. And most individuals up until now have needed to receive a needle two or three times each and every week for their entire life. And when you imagine how difficult that would be to continue that and to never miss doses and to uh, get these regular needles, um, starting when you're very, very young. So parents are having to administer these needles themselves to their children when they're one or two or three years of age. So it's very difficult. So there is now a big movement, a big push to develop longer acting factory concentrates that don't need to be given two or three times a, a week, but instead can be given once a week or maybe once every two weeks or even potentially once every three weeks or so. So what this particular presentation was, was the results of a pediatric uh, study on a new longer acting factor nine that is made by a company known as Novo Nordisk. And on this study, 25 children younger than 12 years of age were placed onto the study in which they got treated with once a week treatment. And what we found is that these children did incredibly well. So for a period of a year, we had a total of 25 boys on treatment, getting treated only once a week. Prior to the study, most of these boys were receiving two or three treatments each and every week. And on this product, not only did they have a lot less infusions of factor, but in addition, they essentially had no bleeding whatsoever. So we've taken a disease that used to cause a lot of bleeding, and we've essentially eliminated bleeding in this condition with once a week treatment. So it really is a big shift and sort of a revolution in the management of hemophilia.